Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Sagittarius. So this is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies, guys. What's coming up for your general energies? We have a lot of growth, a lot of knowledge. You're gaining a lot of knowledge. You're studying about a lot of things, whether it be like for your growth, maybe also, okay, with the dog, people are really loyal to you or you you don't doubt people anymore of staying not loyal to you because I see a lot of loyalty from everyone around you. So you can trust everyone around you, Sagittarius. It's nothing like you have to not doubt anyone and you don't have need to doubt anyone because I see a lot of loyalty with the dog, okay? With the wisp, you're like making all of your negative energy disappear or you're not dealing with anyone negative anymore that's a great thing or you're not talking to people who are negative or who are like lying to you these days you're not talking to people who are like lying to you okay with the choices you have a lot of choices to make in your lives so just uh, make sure whatever you do or whatever choices you make you make the correct choices okay so you're making the correct choices make sure you really are like focusing on all of your choices because some of the choices might be really irritating and you're just making these choices okay so it might be really irritating for you to decide what choices to make because it might be irritating for some of you okay so that's what i see here guys so let's see what's coming up for your love energies now enough of the general energies right your love energies was coming up guys we have the queen of pentacles we have the ace of pentacles we have the queen of pentacles so you're just waiting for this person to give you love and you're just kind of confused whether to wait or not and with this you're just holding on to this person so tight and this person's not coming towards you and you're just kind of being non-emotional you want to travel towards them but you don't want to at the same time you want to change but you don't want to and this person is also like wanting to come towards you but they don't want to okay we have the king of wands up i mean king of swords upright and queen of swords in reverse so though this person wants to come towards you but you are just don't, you just don't want this person to come towards you it's just like just stay wherever you are i'm seeing someone new so you're just kind of in that vibe also some of you okay but some of you are like also wanting this person to come towards you and that's the opposite for some of you okay but I think if you're dealing with your old person still, you're still on their mind, they're still thinking about you, you're still the one for them. They're always thinking about you guys, okay, but they really feel that you're the one for them. They're continuously thinking about you, which is like, even like, they're feeling irritated about the way they're thinking about you. They're just thinking about you a lot with these clouds I see here. This person is thinking about you a lot. They want to change, but they're not able to change and they really want you because they feel you were loyal to them and they were the one who did something that made you like leave them so they really miss you a lot that's what i see here for you all my lovely sagittarius so this is all i have for you guys your lucky color for today is red and your lucky crystal for today is calcite bye guys see you all tomorrow So hi guys, how are you all doing my lovelies? This is going to be another very general message from your person reading. So it's like a pick a card reading. I will be laying out three cards and you get to choose uh, one from these three piles. Okay, let me just lay out these piles guys. If you have any questions to ask me, you can ask me in the comments or maybe I will come live maybe day after or day after tomorrow or maybe on 
this sunday so you can like ask me any questions that time when i come live okay okay guys so these are the piles that i have laid out you can choose any pile that you want to and i will give you a message the message from your person how are they thinking about you how are they feeling about you do they love you do they still care about you and everything about this person and about your connection with this person okay so make sure to close your eyes and meditate for about five to ten minutes okay just pause the video and start meditating and you can choose a pile and you can start the reading okay open your eyes and see which pile attracts you the most and choose that pile okay i will start this is the pile number one two and three so i'll start with the pile number one now pile number two and three please wait uh please someone put the timestamps in the what they say comments so that it will be easy for the others to kind of like get with the reading okay guys i'm really sorry fine so for the pile number one for those who chose the pile number one let us see what is actually came up for you guys how does this person think about you feel about you okay so you need to release this person out for those of you who chose this pile i think like you're really like clingy to this relationship you're clingy on this person so you need to try to release this person out of your life to kind of have this person forever in your life so try to release this person out i know it might sound crazy it might sound a little weird but please start try at least to kind of like release this person out of your life otherwise it is going to be really hard for you to make this relationship possible okay because you need to release this person out otherwise they're not going to come otherwise they're not going to crave for your love they're not going to crave for your attention so please make sure to release this person out and yes they are going to crave for your attention after that okay you always take the pain away we are independent individuals yet when we are together we are inseparable so all i can see here with this person is that guys they really do care too much for you they do love you too much they care too much for you and they're even willing to do whatever they have to to kind of have this relationship with you guys because they're very concerned about you they're very concerned about your life they're very concerned about having this relationship with you and yes guys that is again what i can see here my lovely who chose the pile number one so this person does care too much for you and caring too much can be a problem too in some cases so if you don't feel comfortable with this person if you feel like they they're not the one for you if you feel like they're not caring for you you just don't feel like this is the relationship for a lifetime or if you're having a lot of negative feelings negative uh, energy towards this connection it's okay guys don't think too much everything is going to go according to your expectations but please don't think too much don't hurt yourselves thinking a lot because it is again going to get you into a bad energy it is again going to get you into a bad feeling okay so that is again what i can see here my lovelies i hope you got the overall energies guys my lovely who chose the pile number one and yes i hope this reading really resonated with you guys if it did make sure to watch my weekly monthly and pick card readings my lovely who chose the pile number one this person definitely loves you but you need to let go of them if you're going to stay clingy it is not going to work out okay so let us move on to the pile number two okay so for those of you who chose the pile number two guys 
this is the reading for you guys your dreams need a practical plan you would do anything i say you turn me on so what i can see here is that this person definitely loves you but they feel like this relationship is not possible i don't know why they're getting a very negative feeling with them i don't know why they're being very negative but they definitely love you i would never say that they don't love you they don't care for you they're definitely very very concerned about you they do love you a lot they very um they would do anything to kind of manifest a relationship with you all that is definitely that but also i can see here that this person guys has a lot of other things that they need to manifest it is not just you that they're thinking about they have a lot of other things that they need to care for that they need to manifest and that can also be the reason why they're not coming towards you because there are a lot of other things that they're manifesting a lot of other things that they're caring for and yes uh, this is also what i can see for you here guys my lovelies and I hope you got the overall energies, my lovely, who chose the pile number two. And I can also see here that this person feels very physically attracted to you. They feel emotionally drawn to you and they also feel like you would obey them. You would do whatever the, you have to, to make them happy. So this person loves you because they feel like you would uh, definitely like understand them and obey them so this is all i can see here guys for you for those who chose the pile number two now i'll be moving on to the pile number three okay so we have work through your fears this person is scared to come towards you that is a major uh, that is a major energy for those who chose the pile number three this person has some fears that is not allowing them to come towards you they're scared of how intense this relationship is they're scared of how comfortable they feel with you they have a lot of fears that is stopping them from coming towards you and this person feels like you can read their innermost thoughts you can understand them completely you do whatever they you have to with them like this person generally is very very concerned about you they're very drawn to your energies they do understand you completely and that is again the major energy that the feeling is to come towards you guys okay so this is all i can see here and this person also w is very very concerned about you and they will come towards you soon but it might take a while for a few of you if you're especially a cancer pisces scorpio this person will come towards you soon if you are a uh, taurus Virgo, capricorn aquarius libra gemini it can take time for this person to come okay so bye guys see you all tomorrow don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel bye